This is a message to all my supporters of this podcast. I'm introducing a new supporters program. You can contribute a small amount as a one-off payment to show your love for this podcast. Thank you in advance for all your contributions. I just wanted to let you know before we start the podcast that um, I am doing an online uh, podcast course, how to be able to create, um, get your guests, scale it and monetize it. So uh, please do go to abmpodcastcourse.co.uk um, and be it, go into the contact us bit. Um, I'm looking for new people to be able to be a podcast uh, creator and really to be able to develop their skills and knowledge into a podcast so as i said go to abmpodcastcourse.co.uk and sign up thanks hi this is mark hayward from the absolute business mindset podcast and youtube channel today is mindset monday and we're going to talk about prioritizing yourself so why do i talk about this on a mindset monday conversation or talk um because um Unfortunately, in life, if you don't prioritise yourself, you won't be able to give back at a later stage. Whether it's it's personal finance and you're paying yourself uh, before you pay other providers that you're that you're giving to yourself, or whether it's uh, prioritising yourself on a um, learning a new skill, going on a course. Uh, reading a book. Um, so in all aspects of your life, you, you need to also, it from a personal point of view, if you want to be able to provide for your kids, you need to be happy in yourself and what you're doing um, so you can give to your kids, give to your wife or partner, whoever it is. Because I think it's far too easy. I have experienced this with members of my family who have prioritised everyone else apart from themselves and I can tell you this is a hard honest truth that the people that give all the time don't ever last very long I've experienced it and uh, I've had very altruistic people in my life and unfortunately they have passed away because they are not prioritizing their health prioritizing their career uh, prioritizing their finances and they're not thinking long term so um so i can talk of experience that unless you prioritize yourself now don't get me wrong we're not going to be selfish completely selfish people you need to be able to provide to friends family colleagues whoever it is people that are important to you and be there for people and sit down and have conversations with your friends when they're going through bereavement, de- uh, uh, divorce, or um, just tricky times. Sometimes it can just be a career or a business which is having trouble, and you should be available for other people, but that should not be of detriment to yourself. You should not be giving all the time and never be able to to give something to yourself because you do need that selfishness a little bit as well, and you need to be able to say, I want this and I'm going to get it, and then once you get it, you're a happier person. You're a more generous person. You're a more sharing person because you said, I need this and I need to get this right. And I need to, whether it's financial, whether it's spiritual, whether it's emotional, whatever it is, you need to give yourself something before others. And so I would say, go out there, be generous, be altruistic but never forget yourself in this whole um this whole world that we're living in this life what we're living in which can sometimes be hard and can be a challenge but you need to give yourself time to be able to sometimes people think about things and you need to think about them but equally share things with people because when people need you you need to be able to have them available as well So thank you again so much for your support, for your subscription, for your downloads, for your listens. I really appreciate it. It's a great comfort to me for doing this for you. Thanks a lot, guys. Speak to you soon.